This is Code.org. I'm currently working on CS Discoveries, their physical computing unit, and I'm on the lesson circuits and physical prototypes. Creating board objects. You might have noticed new blocks we're using are in a different toolbox drawer. The circuit draw, uh, drawer contains all the board objects that are built into the circuit playground, but when you start wiring your own circuits, the Maker Toolkit no longer knows where everything is. The new Maker draw drawer contains general purpose commands instead of ones that are customized for the circuit playground. In addition, the pin mode and digital write commands you've seen. It includes commands to create new objects on the board that can be programmed in the same way as blocks in the circuit drawer. The variable LED equals create LED. Ah, we're making a new, got it. Command, for example, creates a new LED object and behaves just like the LED blocks you've been using. Do this. Now that you've been creating new board objects that we don't have blocks for, you'll need to work in text mode. You can still drag out blocks that you're familiar with from the circuit drawer. You'll need to change the name of the object. Keep your LED wire just as it was before, connected to pin 2. It is perfect. Drag out an LED blink block below the command slash slash blink my LED. LED blink block. Up oh, there's what? Nope, that's interval. LED blink block is drag out under circuit toggle. Oh, no, blink interval. Yep, there we are. Replace the text. Uh the text with my LED. So replace the text LED with my LED, my, and then is it capitalized LED? Yes. So capital L. Oh, and notice that we created this variable named my LED and said whatever create LED, whatever is attached to the second circuit is now my LED. Now we use that variable dot blink so we're using a blink property and i bet it blinks at 200 milliseconds uh per second let's give it a shot boop boop it works that's super cool awesome i can't wait to see what we're making next let's uh keep going